Look at that. Greg, that was a game, obviously, where the defense had to make some big plays, turnovers, Yeah, I mean, for us, it's always important, you know, to go out there and hold it down. So, I mean, us up front, we try to get off the ball every single play and do our, do it, just do our 111th. And we got dogs behind us like Poe and them, and we know they're going to handle up. So, I mean, it's, it's team defense. It's not one without the other. So, yeah, we got it done. But how much more accountability did you guys take going into this game, knowing you were without Von Miller, knowing you guys needed to step up? Was there an increased level? Yeah, of we, we know we, we know we got to step up, but Vaughn's still with us. You know, he's still. He's still paying attention. He's still he's still in our meetings on the phone and Zoom, all that stuff. So I mean, like we're, we're doing it. We're doing it for him. We're doing it for us. So I mean, he's, we don't we don't see it as he's out. We just see it as we got to step up, do our one eleventh out there, and make plays and get the job done. Jordan, you've watched a lot of different pass rush moves that your time in the NFL. So what have you seen from the unit today that allows you guys in the secondary? Yeah, same thing they've been doing all season, man. Um, shoot, it was us in the secondary, literally. Going to just give them a half a second, give them an extra half a second to get to the quarterback. We're just trying to hold our hold our end on the back end, and our, like guys like Greg, AJ, DQ coming up with the huge plays today. Um, and you know, we knew it was going to be a test. That's a good football team coming in here, and uh, you know, we played well defensively, and uh, we want to continue to move that moving forward. Yeah, I'm sure, you got. Yeah. Yeah. I wouldn't say it's a concern. It's definitely a point of emphasis, though. Um, you know, there's probably some things that that we could, we as players could do better um, on the back end. Um, you know, whether it's where our eyes are, or just fundamentals or technique. Um, I wouldn't say it's a concern, but it is definitely a point of emphasis. You know, we got to be able to get off the field on third and long. Um, you know, when we get them in those situations, those are situations we should be looking our chops at. You know, and so um, we'll look at the tape and, and figure out you know different ways. Um, that, you know, whether it's fundamentally or whether it's technique or whether it's our eyes. Um, to get off the field. Greg, on, that, on the sack of Flacco, did, it looked like somebody else bumped him your way because he turned around and all of a sudden you were in the flat. Did you, did you, did you see who was forcing him your way when you got him there? No, nah, for me, I was just rushing. I went uh, I went speed to power, started off with, like, I was on a double swipe. I felt that it was kind of oversetting me, and I just came underneath. It, but I know I know for sure the, um, the secondary obviously holding up, and then I got three of the dogs out there with me rushing. So, I mean, it's, it's really our mentality is kind of like four equals one. You know, like I can win on one side, if somebody else can win, then if somebody else isn't doing their job, then the quarterback just gets flushed out and runs away. So it's four equals one every single play we make. Greg, did it feel like you guys were getting more effective as the game was going on? Yeah, I feel like with any game, with anything in life, you kind of get a rhythm. And as it, like you said, as the game goes on, we were definitely getting more comfortable. Uh, I know they were giving us a lot of chip looks. So sometimes that's something that could kind of like throw us off a little bit. But for the most part, yeah, we were getting after it. I think I, for acknowledging, I think you got hurt in the first meeting with the Jets this year, mm -hmm. if I'm not mistaken. But looking at the bit tape that's important for you, too, I mean, when that game was on the line, they ran it on you guys in New York. There was a line of scrimmage situation where they took advantage. Today, it seemed like you, there was a mentality that you guys weren't going to let that happen. Yeah, 100%. We always go out there with that mentality. Sometimes it, sometimes it doesn't go the way we want it to go, but it's always that man whooping man mentality, that just doing our 111, stopping the run, affecting the quarterback, and taking the ball away mentality week after week. It doesn't really change for us. Yeah, I feel like we're hitting strides. Um, you know, we're still obviously wanting to continue to get better. There's some, like I said, like uh, like I said, third and longs. We definitely want to be able to get off the field um, in those situations. But you know, we're trending in the right direction. It was a it was a good football team that we beat today. We got another good football team coming in here next week that you know we got to pre uh, prepare well and, and we're gonna have to play extremely well to win. So um, you know, we're gonna enjoy this one tonight um, and then we're gonna move forward and turn the page tomorrow. <laughs> Whatever phrase calls, we run it. I mean, if he wants to start dialing up blitzes and pressure's getting there, like, you know, we got to hold it down on the back end. You know, that's just, you know, we bring in five. That means, you know, there's a lot of one on ones on the outside. So, you know, Dane had a hell of a game. You know, there's probably some plays he went back, but he made a huge play at the end of the game. Um, and, and, you know, we just, like I said, want to keep trending in the right direction. This is December football, and this is, when you really, this is where you want to play your best ball. <laughs> Always, yeah. There, that definitely Every game. seems like it. And he got to catch the ball, though. He knows that. <laughs> <laughs> he getting. I didn't hit him. He well, hit him a lot. Yeah, yeah. Was it ever you when a guy keeps coming back like that? I mean, I got a lot of respect for Mike. Um, a guy, shoot, you saw him on the ground. He's taking some hits. 
he kept coming back and he kept battling for his team. So a lot of respect for for Mike. And uh, you know, like I said, that's a good football team. Um, you know, those guys they probably want some throws or some plays that they, they that they had back. But uh, you know, we're we're fortunate enough to come out with the victory. Like I said, we want to keep trending in the right direction. Jordan, when you could see the in, in, a, in a game like tonight with the conditions the way they were, is that conducive to the defense or more than the offense? I mean, you guys played good, there's no doubt, but it seems like you guys have a little bit of an advantage in this that league with that. Uh, I mean, it just—it probably depends on who you're asking. Um, I don't like being cold, uh, but it is part of the game, you know. I, and you know, the team. I remember when I was in Cleveland, first time I came to Buffalo, it was a late December game, and it was snow on the ground. You flying in, and you just see nothing but snow, and then you get off the plane, and that wind chill hits your face. Sometimes that might play a factor as soon as teams step off the plane. So we like to embrace it. We like, we know our crowd's right behind us, and you know, rain, sleet, or snow—they're gonna be there loud as hell, and uh, and cheering us on. Yeah, I mean that he's Trey's a guy. When I, I I got no worries on that side of the field. You know he plays the hardest position on the field. He, the catches are going to get made. Um, Trey Davis is a guy who likes to take a lot of pride in in, in his craft, and that's a that's an all pro corner that we have out there. And and you know him getting back into it just it puts a lot of pressure off a lot of a lot of us on the back end, even even up front. So um, you know we're we're glad to have him back, and and um, you know we're excited moving forward with him. Is it? Damn, I forgot about that one. What are you asking? Yeah, like I said, we just want to keep trending in the right direction. There's some plays that we all probably wish we had back. I know I wish that I had a couple plays back, that, but that's the NFL. That's the game. It's not going to be perfect. Um, but we are hitting the strides at the right time, and we want to keep, like I said, trending in the right direction. Yeah, I mean, AJ is a dog. You know, when I came in, when I came in, it was his second year, you know, he's and he's helped me out with a lot of stuff too, just learning everything. And I mean, like I said, out there, he's a dog. We All of us are dogs up front. Me, AJ, Boogie, uh, Shaq Lawson, you see the effect that we can have on the game. And we just got to keep on stepping up down the stretch. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it.